What's going on everybody, Raccoon Eggs here, and chances are that if you watch Raccoon Eggs videos, a touch of a woman is unfamiliar to you. However, in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you 5 easy steps to becoming a pussy black belt. Anyone can do it, even you. It doesn't matter how fat or gay you are, as long as you follow these steps, you are guaranteed to get some mad snatch. So without further ado, let's get right into step 1. Enter my giveaway. I'm going to be giving away a well-worn M4A1S masterpiece in this video, and if you actually win the damn thing, you're going to have a major advantage over everyone else when it comes to getting pussy. I know it's not the best skin in the world. I mean, it used to be factory new, but I didn't know you're not supposed to put it in the washer. So all you have to do to enter is leave a comment on this video, and I'll be using a random comment picker to select a winner in my next video. You've got a pretty good chance to win since my channel is tiny, so I encourage you to enter, but even if you don't win, you can still get some pussy by watching the rest of this video. So good luck everybody, and with that, let's get into step two. Prepare to leave your house for the first time ever. Put down your crusty anime body pillow and wipe the Cheetos crumbs off your rolls, because because for today's tutorial, you're gonna have to venture outside. But there's a few things you're gonna need to do before you open that front door. First of all, you're gonna need to pick a good fashionable outfit that'll catch the female eye. A few examples of good fashion include thrasher t-shirts, beard beanies, crocs, and any brand of pants that ends right above the ankle. Next, you're gonna need to find yourself a sweet ride. You could try hunting for pussy in a Lamborghini, but we all know you don't have a Lamborghini, so instead, you're gonna have to settle for the next best thing, a Razor scooter. <laughs> when the ladies see you cruising around on this bad boy, Boy, you're guaranteed to instantly become a blowjob magnet. Oh, and uh, don't forget to wear your helmet, too. Now you're gonna have to fix up a good hairstyle. Nobody's gonna want the dick if you look like a bird's nest, so grab some hair gel and go to work. You can try going for any of these hairstyles, or just whip out the scissors and give yourself a Call Me Carson bull cut. And finally, the last thing you're gonna wanna do is tape a printout picture of some abs on your stomach to make women think you're ripped. Now that you're sexy as fuck, it's time for step three. Scout out the perfect pussy. Congratulations, you're now ready to begin pussy hunting. And you know what that means, it's time to venture outside. And what what better place to hunt for pussy than a day cake? I'm, I mean, the bar. I'm on an FBI watch list now. Sick. Head to the nearest bar and bring some binoculars to maximize your pussy hunting capabilities. But once you've locked onto a female, you can't just go up and talk to her. This is a common mistake that a lot of people make. Being confident in your ability to have a normal conversation is the last thing you want to do. Instead, you're going to want to stalk her for a good month. Find out everything you can about her. Her name, birthday, favorite color, previous boyfriends, religious beliefs, and favorite mixtape. The more insignificant details you know about about her, the more likely you are to get to pop that cherry. Once you feel like you're ready to talk to her, it's time to move on to step four, tame the pussy. Now that you know everything there is to know about her, it's finally time to move in and seduce her. The best way to make a first impression on a female is with a pickup line. You might think pickup lines are creepy, but actually they're scientifically proven to stimulate the part of the female brain responsible for orgasm. Try something like, are you a Minecraft dirt block because I'm digging you, and she'll instantly get drenched. Once you've got her attention, it's time to start bringing up things she likes to give her the illusion that you have something in common. Remember, not being subtle is key. You know, I've always really been attracted to people that were born on August 25th at 3.29 a.m. That's just always been the kind of person I click with, especially if their name is Bertha and they like to ride a dildo every day before work. Ha, <laughs> oh shit, that sounds exactly like me. How'd you know? Because I've been watching you in a tree for the past month, dumb fuck. Step 5, conquer the pussy. If you've done everything right up until now, then chances are that shit's starting to get steamy, so it's about time you crush that pussy like an empty soda can. It's right recommended you use a condom if she's ugly, otherwise feel free to poke a bunch of holes in the tip. Once you've got her in your bedroom, light some candles, whip out your micro dick, and prepare for the best five seconds of your life. And don't forget to yell subscribe to Raccoon Eggs as you nut. I'm giving you this guide for free, so it's the least you can do. Thank you guys for watching, if you enjoyed the video make sure you cream pie that like button, and check out my links in the description, as well as the how-to playlist for more videos like this one. And yeah, this has been Raccoon Eggs, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out and good luck with the giveaway, you fuck. Fucking